Hey guys, I'm Keith, and today we have a very simple project for us to try. We're going to make a custom electrical switch outlet using composite mold, composite cast, and mixed material. Okay, so I'm going to be making a mustache man. Let's get started. In my light switch plate, I'm going to be molding a variety of mixed materials. Have a little fun and get creative. Experiment using different objects. I do suggest to stick with flatter objects because it makes it a lot easier in the future. Unless you're using just clay, you're probably going to want to glue down the materials to the light switch plate so it doesn't float away in the composite mold. Alright, there we go. This is my mustache man and we're going to be putting this guy in composite mold and then we're going to be using composite cast afterwards to turn this all into plastic. Alright, on to the composite mold part! After gluing down your light switch plate to the bottom of your bowl, pour in the hot composite mold. In my bowl, I use tin foil and a wax paper liner. This makes it easy, so I can take the wax paper right out of the bowl. Now go ahead and start peeling all the wax paper off. Now carefully take all of your items out of the composite mold. I made mine a little bit difficult so I had to use a knife to get out the glasses. Okay so I have composite cast right here and now I'm going to mix them together with a 1 to 1 ratio to make the plastic. There's a 20 minute cure time so no worries if you're kind of slow. For this part of the experiment I suggest wearing safety glasses and gloves. Carefully pour in the mix, and be sure to cover all areas evenly. To avoid spilling, make sure your composite molds on a nice and level surface. After about 20 minutes, your light switch plate is done and is ready to be taken out of the composite mold. Depending on how well the process went, you might have to clean up your plate a little bit. Paint it up, and you now have your very own custom light switch.